Gentlemen, ADS Blue 101 here, and welcome back to Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Um, last time where we left off, last where we left off, I was uh, exploring the underground uh, chasm, my first chasm, and um, I ended up uh, exploring around. Notice I got like markers everywhere because there's undecayed weapons. And I think we can go back to the Hyrule Castle Ruins and give them to that guy who was trying to collect them. Uh, I, th I think that'll be possible. Um, there's quite a few down here, so I think I could spare a couple for that guy. But, uh, yeah, I wanted to travel around and see if I could find, like, a, a stable or something down here. But apparently they don't have one. Or at least I ain't found it yet. But I did find a checkpoint look like. I think we get another ability from right here. Authorize a fire. Why is my audio not going up? There we go. Converting auto build to authorizer. Please utilize it as you explore to, uh, and excavate the depths. Instantly recreate your Ultra Hand projects using nearby items in Zoanite. Auto build records your previous creation. Okay, dope. So now we can make something crazy and we ain't got to worry about making it a second time. We can just go to the auto build and just, just do that. Incredible. Could you give us a demonstration? Let's see what the text has to say. Hold on. Um, this ability will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced. Ah. I know just what to use it on. Any luck, both of our vehicles just broke, and we've been struggling to put it back together again. Oh. And one of the round pedestals lost a wheel. Ah. And the other square pedestal has fallen to pieces. But I think if you put the wheel back on the first one, we should be able to use your power to repair the second <laughs> one in no time flat. So come on, let's see it in action. You can start by repairing the one on the round pedestal. Something up with those two. That's probably a boss fight, because it's like a big area up front. Look, when it comes to games like this, any large area like they had in front of this mine, it, there's a boss battle coming up. Brother, them leggies are looking t teetered this time to take. It's time to take air, air bite. Wait, hold on. Brother, them leggies are looking tired. It's time to air bike, take the sky, and split the face of God. <laughs> oh, shit. I mean, hopefully I can make something like that. Let's, uh... Let's touch this. Now it's time for the main event. The one in pieces is a square pedestal. Use that p new power of yours. Fix it up. Lickety split. My brother, I have the schematics. I can aid you. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the schematics soon. That's dope. It's like I'm seeing double, but in less time, less than no time flat, this is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, ancient power. The texts were right after all. Ganon will fear you once you have mastered the military industrial college. Hey, I've seen a lot of people make some crazy stuff. I knew it. It's them fucking Eager Clan people. I knew, I knew something was up. I just knew it. Both of you. I 
knew it. Credit where credit is due. That's yes, credit where credit is. Drones, my brother. It's all about the drones in this game, as well as the last. If, or if there's one foe I'll, I'll never forget, it's the man who cast me from Gerudo Desert Hideout. It was you. Now I live in vengeance both upon that no good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy. That means you, Link. We meet again at last. Don't worry to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. I hear my name with tremble in fear. I am the leader of the Eagle Clan. I just got Ginyu Force written all over it. Master Koga. I know for a fact this dude. I knew something had to be up with them too. They was a little bit too excited to me for me to fix things. I saw the moment you obtained the ancient power we saw for so long and I highlighted this industry's old text we found in this land. I remember objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them. Long, la long lasting ability from distant past. So you, you, you're cheating. And we're working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand. And you could just whip them up in an instant. That's not fair. Appreciate the light, Chop Mama. And you know who could have used that power? The one who we worship and revere, the Magnificent One. We offered it to him. He could have crushed you and Zelda both. And you just walked up and snatched it away. Now I'm going to snatch it back. Oh! Prepare yourself. I'm not gonna do sit here and act like you're just gonna run me over. What hell my bombs at? My bow broke soon as I soon as I fired it. Oh shit! I know what we gotta do. If I can copy that that build that he did, you pest. Why won't you just stand still and let me squish you? Oh, well, fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for the day. You think you're so smart, but I've already found a whole bunch of ruins down here. I saw your little trick. You used your right hand to construct that thing. I grabbed myself the power you cheated me out of myself at the southwestern abandoned mine. Then the magnificent one and I will guide this world to a miserable end and there's nothing you can do to stop us the southwest abandoned mine keep that in mind they don't follow me this dude had an airplane wow dude what is this master of the eagle clan Equal to 100 normalized crystal charges. Excuse me. Thank you for repelling the trespassers. I hope you'll pardon me for listening to your conversation. But that man mentioned the abandoned mine to the southwest. I suspect that he is referring to the former Gerudo mine. That place flourished with activity long ago. Like this one, ore was constantly unearthed and refined. And the statues that point that way are... The point that went to the abandoned... Follow. The statues that point that way to the abandoned mine. There are stat there are statues that point that way. Follow them and reach that destination. I recommend by taking by making your way to the light you see over there. One more thing before you head on your journey. 
There's something that helps me with my associate. Okay. Thank you for drawing our trespassers. I will no longer need to hide in order to avoid detection. Yeah, here's another good reason I've come. It means to skim a stone. Oh, it gave us a fan plane. Okay, dope. The new design has been registered for your auto build. And you should now be able to build an additional design. Please wait as I prepare the necessary parts for you to test this. Okay. Dope. I need to find out ways how to take pictures. Because I know I gotta do that for that uh for that scientist back at the lookout. Let's get my stones. I hope you find this useful. There's two things I gotta do. I gotta make batteries. Oh, I like that bow, I just don't like the fact that it shoots three of them. Controller. Do they have a controller around right here? They do not. They got no control sticks. Nothing. At least we got a fast travel point. Now I want to make Zonai. Let's speak none of that. How many do you require? Shit, I'm taking all of them. That are available. There are five, fifteen pieces. In there. Okay. When I just process by smelting it in the furnace, thereby converting into materials with useful properties. Zone I charges are. Materials to create your energy cells. Okay, so where the hell do I get more batteries? Anybody know how to know how to make more batteries to that zone? I
bet. Cause I, I I didn't know the game didn't tell me, so I didn't I wasn't aware. But I got people like y'all telling me what's up. Yo, go to the sky uh, sky island. In the campsite. Okay. It's easier if you're if you have a shrine by it. And we're off. Sky Island. Oh wait a minute! Is it that same shrine? Oh yeah, never mind. I know that shrine. I know that shrine. That's what we had to go back to before we um. That was the place that we got the rewind time ability. That's the place where we got the ability to uh, go back in time or to rewind time. My bad. I know exactly what you're talking about. I'm talking about the main island. That's right here. Yep, right there. Nope, it's right outside the camp of Hyrule. It's, it costs 100 crystallized charges. Wait. The first camp in Hyrule. Hold on, y'all gonna have to show me. Because it's one of them things, you, you, you get so caught up in the game, you, you miss this stuff. Or well, I missed it. I don't know if anybody else missed it. Yeah, there's zone eye right outside, okay. Because I know that it was one where you have to, like, Ascend through the the ceiling and go off to the side. Oh, never mind. It was this one. To the north. It's the crystal refinery. Oh, okay. Here we go. Two energy wells. So, so I'm about to start farming those. But I need as many of those batteries as possible. Yeah, more battery cells. That's I mean, I thought I was supposed to get it from where I was. Okay, it's, it's two things I gotta do, and you guys could probably help me out with it. Um, one, I gotta find the picture ability, and I think I gotta go back to Lookout Landing to get it, right? Cause that old man wanted me to take pictures of the um of the of the statues, but that old man wanted me to take pictures of statues, but I don't have no way to take pictures of them. I think I gotta go back to Lookout Landing and talk to him or something. Yeah, you talk to Robbie or Joshua Pro's assistant. Okay. Bet. Cause I, I literally like... <laughs> man. Because you get so caught up in the side content of this game that you miss the important stuff. Like, like this game got a lot to do. I mean, a lot. Okay, so I gotta talk to Poor's assistant. I think I stuck. There are so many things to do. That's what I yeah, like they like they actually did for Breath of the Wild. I'm seriously considering going back and playing Breath of the Wild because a lot of people have been asking me to. Alright. Where was this old man and this kid? I think it was underneath here. Uh 
You can find chasms. You can find the chasm that Goggles headed for straight out lookout landing in the south gate. I think he plans to enter the depths from there. Sorry, I can't tell you a thing about how the camera works. It's just how it captures the images. Thing. So if you figure, so if you, so if you find a figure down there that looks like the one I showed you, and get a picture of it for me, please. Also, he's already there. Okay, so I already activated this. Okay, first things first, let's do these poses. Um, I bet you're interested in the strange stones. Those are both a form. I'm the one who turns pose to the afterlife. There are pose for you. Oh, this is indeed a pose. What a pitiful thing these are. They have lost their way. I have returned the lost spirit to the afterlife where I belong. Since I was brought here to the surface, I have been unable to return pose to the afterlife. Because of you, I can assist them once more. You take this. A dark clump. Double J, appreciate the follow. I'm going to update your name in a little bit. If you offer me pose, I will give you suitable compensation. Dark tonic. Well, we getting this. That shadow, uh... I think that shadow link, uh... Stuff, ain't it? Ten pounds, I'll tell you. Already an abandoned mine. If you find those statues, you get more pieces. I think it's seven or a full set, maybe nine. That's Shadow Link. That's Shadow Link stuff. Alright, uh. They say he's already here. I don't know, he must have been on the outside of the chasm. I must have went in there too soon. I swear, I like y'all, man. Like, y'all know how to help somebody, man. I actually appreciate that. Because I would have been lost for a minute. I, I'm, I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, where's this old man at? That old dude got to be around here somewhere. Cause they, they, they're telling me to, to jump straight down, but he wasn't down there last time I went. Or, you know, he probably is. I probably just didn't look. told me to guide you to him once you arrived, but he rushed with such haste, he didn't bring enough light to those scenes. Ah. Throw a short work in the glowing area. And he just kept going. Going. Last I saw him, he was headed out west, off to the west. Hey, total. on. And only been the first one. <laughs> it's crazy. Because everywhere is fun to explore. I played for maybe 10, 20 hours and only did the first main quest. Hey, that happens. That happens, bro. Uh -huh. That happened to me. That's the reason why I'm I'm so behind on the story. I was thinking I'm doing something. The whole time, I'm doing side content. Didn't even realize it. And I didn't even mind because the game was actually fun. Because now that I got the auto build ability, I, I, I just want to build stuff. The simplest way is just throwing with your hand. And it's crazy now that they said it. It's, uh, they telling me this uh -huh. now. I didn't already figure out all the controls from parrying to flipping all this before the game even told me. They probably tell me later on, but I'm, I didn't already figure all this stuff out. 
That's crazy. Hey, that's skeleton horses down here, I believe. I think they got a skeleton horse down here. I gotta find a way. They don't just give you the cardinal directions ahead of time. They, they don't. Random live. Well, it's not random. I'm always uh, I'm, I'm always live streaming. Maybe if you hit the follow button, you would know that. Another fire right here. This look like monsters though. This don't look like where he was. There you go. Hit that follow button. Appreciate the follow. Matter of fact, let me update y'all names. Who was the last person? Double J and uh and Derek. Uh, I, I put y'all in there real quick. Derek Wynn. Boom. There we go. Got y'all. Appreciate it. Okay. Well, let's get. Uh, what? Hey, you got the champion stunner? I don't even know what that is. Oh, no, you got to cheese it. So you got to fly from the Lookout Landing Skyview Tower and go to Hyrule Castle. It's in there. So, matter of fact, let me just show you on the map. Like, from Lookout Landing, the Skyview Tower here, you launch up and you just fly into Hyrule Castle. But make sure you have enough, uh, like, recharge elixirs, or at least a couple recharge elixirs, because that's, that's going to help you make it there. That's where you get it. By doing it like that, you can get it pretty early in the game. Oh, what the heck? Man. Yeah, eat an eyeball. Oh, I didn't even touch our little castle. It was scary enough. <laughs> uh, the castle's in ruins. They got a bunch of... Co oh, there he is. Wait a minute, you didn't tell me I passed this dude up already when I was exploring down here? I passed him up, literally. Wow. Because I already had that activated. What? Look at how bright that thing got. It's like down here is refreshing. Okay. Like we're on the surface. Just standing near it makes me feel so much better. How strange. Hey, it's you. You're finally here. I need to show you what I found. A statue. It's tall. It's standing tall on two legs, one arm raised high. It looks an awful lot like a, a figure Joshua showed us in that piece of slate. Don't you think? And the music makes it ten times more intimidating. <laughs> All right, get that camera ready. You know the poor pad. It's a Nintendo Switch. Call it what it is. There's the problem. Your camera is locked. And so is your Hyrule Compendium. Hold on. If I remember correctly, if you press this while you pull this and tap that. Wow, so a button combination unlocked the camera ability. Now why would now here's the dumb question. Why would that be locked on this thing? Literally, like why would that be locked? And now you should be able to use your camera and your Hyrule Compendium. So go capture a picture of that statue. Test it out. So all the monsters that we face so far, they're not going to be in the compendium. Yeah, how'd that go? If you captured an image with a stat, like I didn't already fought two Lionels already. 
Like, that's how far in the game I am. I didn't fought two Lionels. And I didn't fought the strongest one at Hyrule Castle, up, supposedly. And I fought another one down here. So I, so I didn't already fought three of them. And I'm still getting, you know, you got to take pics of them in a while. <laughs> so you mean to tell me I got to go fight the damn Lionels again? Wow. That's, that's news. So you mean to tell me I got to worry about them? So I probably got to stun them. Shoot them in the face or something. See so you go look out landing. Don't make Joshua wait too long. Or you can buy some picks from Robbie. That's the more efficient thing. I got all these rupees. I'm gonna put them to work. Right, so we gotta get the lookout landing. Hey, quick question for the people that played this already. Is there a stable in the uh in the chasm because I've seen some skeletal horses down here and I gotta take it up to the surface I was exploring down there off cam so how am I supposed to get the horses up there or oh, I'm just supposed to take a picture of it and take it to the guy because it was a dude that asked me to see you can't get the horses up oh that's bullshit Hey, you know what? Hold up. It's probably a way to do it. Like, what if you make like something to, to like float the horse up? Or did somebody already try that? If you try the horse might die of fall damage. I don't know, like, I can build a... It hurts to watch. I, I don't know, like, I might be able to make, like, a cage or something to, to get it to float up. Like, as long as I, like... You know what I'm saying? Build a, a structure. A horse slips through the cage. What do you mean he slips through the cage? That won't make no sense. I don't know. Once I get the materials, I'm gonna try it. I mean, it's already dead. Like, what's gonna happen? Hey, you... I don't know, you could try. <laughs> Joshua, the picture of you, you took of the statue, the figure matches up pretty well. And it looks darn cool, too. Hey. This is it. This does match what's going on in the fragment. Did you beat Breath of the Wild? No, I didn't even play Breath of the Wild before this. That's what I'm saying. Like, I might have to go back and play it. Because I think I'm missing out on some crucial parts of the story. Just like the slate, I figure this may be showing people of some sort. Confirms my theory that people lived in the depths. I'm sure we'll find more traces of them if we keep searching. This is a big, big discovery. I can recap you. I mean, shoot, go for it. Okay. Oh, but before I focus on that, there's something I want to give you that there's a thanks for helping me with earlier. Surveys of the depths found all this. What do you think it's for? It's all at night. I feel as if these contain some sort of strange power like maybe it's energy for something anyway it might help you in your search for princess zelda so hopefully you'll find them useful <laughs> the fragment has helped us see the depths a new way in a new way now we're closer to understanding its mysteries i'm going to sift through everything that our surveys have brought back from down there maybe there's even more fragments than that i can piece together oh, those swords are... thank you so much Completed. All right, this thing got some. I'm still thinking you probably focus on what the doc has. And I know the fragments like this one can help us see the depths in a new way. I'll be searching my collection for more. I'll let you know if that leads to a new breakthrough. Until then, you should probably focus on the investigation at the dock ass with something. So, 100 years ago, Link became Zelda's appointed knight and obtained a Master Sword. Okay. There are four champions from each race. That's probably the sages. 
and John getting a figure for Joshua. I was looking for her. She was pretty happy to see that statue. And I was thrilled to show you how to use the camera. The poor pad has even function, potential functions, you know. Listen up, big update here. The poor pad can be equipped to the sensor that detects shrines. Uh, I'm the first one. Uh, sages were before. The, ah, okay. But these guys were descendants of the sages. Alright, bet. I'm the first one in all Hyrule who noticed the shrines after the upheaval, so I created a sensor to detect them. The only thing is, I can't set up here. Or look out landing. I'd be. It would be nearly impossible unless I'm at the Pearl Pad Research Lab in Hateno Village. That's right. It's a it's a lab dedicated to the enhancement of the Pearl Pad, which I developed. Once I'm at that lab, you'll join me. I can further improve your Pearl Pad with the starting the sensor. You'll find the lab East Nakula. Nakluta, off in the southeast corner of Hyrule, on as far as out of Hateno Village. Go a bit farther than that and you'll see a mighty particular place. Don't let the looks fool you, it's cutting edge lab. But well, for now, Joshua's investigators are our main priority. So until she gets gets further along, I'll be staying here for a while. Okay. Look at the sages before this, but these guys were descendants of the sages. Okay. Let's see. Say Hateno Village. Dude, wasn't I just at a place? Carico Village, right here. They said it's southeast of Hateno Village. Oh, that horse is still right there? Wow. Now that I think about it, I should have been looking for the, uh... For the, what you call them? Ganon took over the giant mix that every champion besides Link wielded. Uh, that explains all the, the building... The building essentials. Champions fell and Ganon took over every piece of the tech and high rule besides shrines. Um, damn, so what are we gonna do now? We can go back to that. I wanna see if I can build that, um. That, what you call them? build that uh well, I gotta get these other pieces to this before I do anything else I gotta get other pieces to this So they put him in a healing shrine in the Great Plateau. Slept, but well, it's left for a hundred years in the healing, healing in the bathtub. So they basically took him to a Lazarus pit. So they took him to a Lazarus pit.
Royal Hidden Passage. So many bomb flowers, yeah. A lot of them. Are you praying for a long life, wealth, kind, whatever? The dealer in life and power, that was me once. Alas, my life for money bargains didn't sit well with the goddess Hyla. She turned me to stone statue long ago. Even then, I continued my bargains as a statue in this village. Still, the goddess did not like what I was doing. I was banished from the main street up to the outskirts of town, scorned and neglected, but that was not enough for her. Again, I was sent away and spent time trapped in a pond, only for fish to accompany and finally here. Perhaps another might have learned a lesson from this, but I have not. No, I have only been biding my time for the moment when someone can hear, hear me appear as someone such as you. I'm sure we can reach a beneficial arrangement. I have to deal with only fish for too long. So that she will strike a bargain. Hold still. Don't fret. I'll take care of everything. This won't hurt a bit. Wait, this thing just took my life? My touch is subtle as ever. Note how I took that essence from you without leaving a mark. Deal with the statue. What the fuck did I gain from that? Break my heart. Right. Talk to him again. You think I would deceive you? Perish the thought. I hope that I was a profit relationship. Give me a heart. Wise choice and remain still. To not to worry. Money and life are all those to me. If you're ready to begin, then first you must sell me either a type of sell me either type of essence for a hundred rupees. If you want me to buy an essence back, their price is 120. Before you cry foul, know that you may choose which one I return to you. Heart container or a stamina vessel. I'm eager to help tamper with your essence anytime you want to return it from here. Wow. This guy is switching your hearts for stamina and other way around. If I wanted to, I could cheese the hell out of this. I, I literally got the means to cheese the hell out of that. I just max out my hearts, max out my stamina from praying to him and then just do something like that. done four sage quests and I have like five hearts but max stamina. I actually want to get the rest of the oh shit there's a like like down there.
overpowered for this section now. This is gonna break anyway. So. Royal broadsword. I don't have a royal broadsword. Increases the power of flurry rush during a perfect dodge. So we're just gonna destroy that. Move. Drop. That's gonna break. Trap with sword. Rocks to regain durability. Octo rocks. Octo rocks. You mean them, uh, the octopus balloons? Let's use octo. What the hell? Bro, this, this put us right in front of Hyrule Castle. Going underneath there took us right to right in front of Hyrule Castle. Or anything. I'm starting to think you're using emulation. I am. Every, like everybody been knew I was using emulation. Everybody been knew that. Like, like that's not a secret. Ooh. Hey, it's the shark lady. What y'all talking about? Steve, you probably protect lookout landing. So I can't see now. I can do that. Oh, oh, she had me. oh, you know what? Since I got the picture, I can go to that. I tried going all the way in that cave and put me inside a Hyrule castle and I got jumped. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. You went. Wait, it, it was more? Hold on. So you tried going all the way in the cave and you got jumped at Hyrule castle. Yeah. Unicorn visions, I got you. Hold on. Hey, yeah, but you got some armor stuff. Yeah. Let's take it all the way in the cave. I think I went this way last time. armor. everywhere, ain't you? Yeah. Oh, listen, better be something down here. Oh. 
another feather. Right back up. Oh, they killed him, no problem. Taking the mobbing things, though. Said there was secret armor. Did, did I pass it up? Or was it down in that water? Take that. Great bricks. Did I pass them up? I didn't pass it up, did I? Okay, I didn't. So I passed up a pile of bricks beforehand. Uh, they, they weren't great. They were just sitting off to the side. Oh, I smell boss battle. I smell boss battle. I smell boss battle. <laughs> Yep, of course it would be. Why wouldn't? Of course it would be boss battle. Why not? sat down while I was in mid-swing. Mid they just sat on me. I, th I thought I would have had enough defense to deal with that. This guy has no name, literally. TM. 
That hurt my feelings a little bit. I ain't gonna front. One thing I gotta give this game credit for is checkpoints. This thing has some real good checkpoints. I hate these giant ass swords, bro. I, I, I lie to you not. I do not like these giant swords. I wonder if you could cheese it and just beat him right here. Tooth. Stalex horn. Knight's halberd. Flint. Tooth. Knight's broadsword. Knight's claymore. Well, sent me a heart. Appreciate the hearts. Uh, which one of these weapons is gonna break? Where is armor supposed to be? Did I pass it up? Did I pass the armor up? Doesn't. 
I was gonna say. Soldiers, bro. Soldiers here. I might want to go back and find that other one. I, I, I think I passed up a chest. Passed up. Uh, who, who shared? Oh, smiley face. Shout out to share. Oh, here go the gray ones. That's great. It is great. Professional boob expert. <laughs> I like that name. Right, we gotta drop this there. We're going to hit these with fire. Spear is great for clearing those. That's exactly what I'm using. Still going great on it. A cannon spear. <laughs> mm. 
It's a vehicle bomb. I don't think I have a structure for that yet. I don't think I have a structure for a vehicle bomb just yet. I'm kind of assed out right now. Will do. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Didn't we get some... There's a bunch of ice in here. Duh. Let's just make a raft. Fusing a cannon to a shield if you have one. Fusing a cannon to a shield. Do I have a cannon? What am I doing? Um, I don't have a cannon. I got a flame emitter. I got a rocket to a shield. Yeah, I don't have a cannon yet. Rockets work two on arrows. A hack version? No. It's not hacked. <laughs> it's emulated, unless you meant that. 